Breakout had uh, some very unique villain sets, a shark with arms, a non-humanoid robot, a two-phase knockoff, and a bee. But Vortex has the most unique color scheme of any construction sets. While Stringer just has his own add-on armor, transparent color body armor, and a guitar. Anyways, Stringer has 42 pieces and Vortex has 61 pieces, with these being the new parts and recolors at the time when it was released. I would start with the hero then the villain, but for this I'm going to start with the villain. Vortex has the color of red, purple, pearl dark grey, black, yellow, and blue. Everything in the color scheme fits together perfectly. The red is mainly the under part of the color scheme, and the purple place on the body armor and the shoulder armor doesn't stick out. Plus, if the purple were blue, would not look that good. Wires with red and blue, though I don't know why the blue wires are both blue and transclear, but them connecting from the head and back to the weapons look very nice and help make Vortex look more like an electric felon. The yellow isn't actually part of his color scheme as you can tell, since it's meant to be all effects of electricity. As for armor placement, are very well done uh, having some bulk in the set. I like that it doesn't have an ultra builder chest armor or printing since they would have to stick out. The back has a foot piece that doesn't cover up that much of the back, but have a switch that doesn't do anything. Unless you have imagination. Hell, if that tentacle piece doesn't make it obvious, I don't know what does. But anyways, there is a bone piece on the neck to give the set a hunch back, which something little like that makes a big difference. Without it, it would have to look pretty bland. The head is very close to being pretty good looking, however the electricity coming out is a bit overboard. I wish those were an option and are connected by watts. Plus the electricity piece and the head or have an axle part that makes the head look pretty odd. Weapons are very basic, they are lightning whip and fault blaster. The blaster used the new at the time version of the Thornax launcher, but doesn't have that other part of the launcher that all of the heroes in Breakout have. Lightning Whip can spin and have a tentacle piece since they don't have any lightning-like whip. Overall with Voltix, he is a fantastic set, a good example of how to do multicolor white, and I recommend this set. It gets a cup of Energizer Bunny. Now on to Stringer who fails to be a bad set. Stringer has the color of black, poor dark grey, blue, and trans dark blue? Okay, the body armor in trans dark blue is questionable of why this was picked instead of black or solid blue, along with picking blue for the secondary color. I mean 1.0 he has orange, 3.0 yellow, breakouts, blue? Did they just skip red and just decided to give him blue instead? Well, the blue does look great on the set and the trans dark blue doesn't stick out unless facing the light. Since they didn't cover up the back. For armor placement is nice though they couldn't have more than a 3 log armor. I mean at least to give it some blue 4 log armor instead of this trans dark blue body armor. As for this add on armor, it fits with its theme of sounds very well of looking like speakers. I wish LEGO put this piece in more sets. Heck, it could have been in Nexo Knight's L1's Knight's vehicle. Helmet is the same helmet from the 1.0 set, which I am all right with since they are fantastic looking helmets. So moving on to the weapon and handcuff. Now I love that we get 3 chain pieces, but the handcuffs are obviously too long. Heck, it drags on the floor with it's stored. The weapon is called a Mega Decibel Sound Blaster. Or a better way to put it, a Guitar Blaster.
It's nice looking with having a 2.0 shield and Ultraviolet Thornax launcher together. To make a guitar is a very interesting combo. But I think turning the shield around would look much better. Overall, this is a pretty good set and has more uniqueness from other hero sets of having its own add-on armor and a guitar, and gets a cup of guitars.